to okay. hear, talk to you about that. Sweet. Um, but Abyss, uh, he is very technical, super technical. Yeah, uh, he is a crazy good fox. Yeah, I've even seen him like use the uh, the shortened for the side Bs where you flip the stage and you get the short. Really? Yeah, yeah, I've seen him do that in Bragg before. That's super hard in Smash 4. Yeah, he's very, very technical. Uh, but he is going to be playing his tweaks, so this is going to be a hell of a fight. I'd like to see, you know, kind of how Abyss does in this situation against yeah. such a good player. Because he is like one of those good players, right? But this right. is like the great player like he is one of the greatest yeah, of number Smash two Wars in history. the world in the world like yeah that's out of everybody yeah and he earned that he, he worked his ass off to yeah. get there he, going from getting 33rd at majors to getting top top, top eights and winning yeah uh, and winning um, yes so and uh one of the things that you're gonna see a lot coming out of tweak is that he doesn't just use his specials he uses a great combination of normals and specials together to create maximum very fluid, pressure right yeah maximum pressure and he is someone who doesn't like you can tell that he's going to go for uh, he's going to go after the, the options that typically avoid the more generic combos like he's ready to follow you yeah even in like that situation he just sort of, like raw up there they just keep chasing super good catching yes. and like if abyss is off stage a lot tweak is just going to de demolish this matchup and so far tweak hitting him off with the nair the up airs just keeping him off the stage even with the fair now oh man that Ooh, air dodge that was good I expected a uh, like an air dodge read back air. Back air, yeah. But like the way he chases you down is super crazy, and uh, like you can tell, like every time he uses a move, he uses it in such a way where he is gonna make sure that he has time to frame trap you. And Abyss getting some good damage there. Uh, Bayo, you know, being a light character, she is comboable. Uh, like yes. she's definitely a com you can definitely combo a Bayo. She falls pretty quick. She's uh, lighter as well as a fast. You know. Like, very easy to hit. But the thing is, you got to always be weary. If it's not frame perfect, which time could be there? Yes. Oh, and the up air, the frame trap. I like how he used regular up air instead of holding it. So that the, when he frame trapped with another up air, it was a strong hit and not just a weak hit. Yep. And now Tweak rolling a little bit with the fair, sending him straight on out. Uh, Abyss is going to recover high, though, which is Ooh. definitely needed in the back air. Not going to quite kill Tweak, but Abyss with the great pressure so far. Abyss got one opening, and he's trying to get this kill. Yeah. yeah, he's looking. I mean, Tweak is at that kind of percent where uh, a lot of mix-ups coming out of Fox will kill. Mm -hmm. It's just that he's also starting to reach that percent where Fox doesn't really get any confirms. Yeah, you saw the jab-jab there, and Tweak was waiting to, for an up smash, hoping to get a punish. And Abyss is seconding the grab, which was really smart. This could Great be some damage. Yeah. Yep. Stringing along. All right, getting out of that combo, but that was a great uh, up air from ledge. Tweak was able to combo two into a special. Instead of starting with a special, he reserved his specials oh. for later on in the combo. Yeah. And that's what's great about, you know. He can start the combo no matter yeah. how, like, whatever situation presents him, he knows what's going to be most optimal, I mean, realistically, yeah. to set himself up to keep dragging you along the stage as well as the blast zone. Um, we are talking over, I think they're asking if it's best of five or best of three, which. That's a fantastic question. I'm assuming best of three at this point. Like, yeah, I don't, I don't think, think they're it'd be flying best five until like 32, winners, 16, at 8. Earliest. Yeah, yeah, probably. Oh, best, best of five. Oh, wow. it is best of five. Let's, All top. let's freaking go, dude. We got time. Yes. We got matches. We're going to see a lot of them, guys. Get excited. Good pivot grab. Yeah. Uh, uh, Abyss starting off pretty strong this game. The, oh. the one thing I noticed with Abyss is that he's done a super great job of keeping his composure and wait, like, he does rack on that damage. He does, you know, the, the big thing with uh, beating top players is that a lot of people struggle to kill. Oh, yeah. And, and that's and important. Being a top player is also knowing how to survive and getting out of death, uh, near death situations. And that's great shield pressure, but that is also pretty good. The yeah. Witch Time setting up for the up smash. That shield was getting really low, but uh, Tweak, he was prepared and ready to go. Like you said, very hard to even put pressure on a player as of his caliber. Yeah, and you can start to see oh, the God. Oh, oh, my Lord. Lord, jeez. Carry him across the stage with just normals. Yeah, it's oh. Such, such an amazing Back thing. air, oh. another one. Can we get? Yep, yeah, that was definitely <laughs> going to take it. Yep. <laughs> that, that. <laughs> you know which one to tech. <laughs> How do you know? Like, you tech the first one, maybe. And yeah, you like, get hit by a second one. Yeah, that's tough. If you, if you press shield during a certain window, you can't tech. Yeah, you're done like, for. Like, you do it too early. Yep. You just miss the window, and then all of a sudden you're falling. And then even the angle of sent in was just vicious. Like, yeah. Okay. Tweak one game two. Took only 17%. Yep. And, like, we we know Abyss is a good player. That's just, like, yeah. the level Tweak yeah. is at. Abyss was doing great game one. Like, yeah. he got Tweak to uh, the percent where he could, you know, he had mix-ups and kill confirms to get that stock. He just couldn't get it because 
Tweak did a, at least he did a good job of avoiding that. Ooh, good damage. This is start. insane. It's a great 43. start. 43. Oh, that, if you would have gotten that up air, I would have not been surprised if that killed. Yeah, that, that was really high up in the blast zone on Town of City, but off the stage now, which time not going to connect there. And uh, Abyss keeping the pressure up, even yes. in the corner. Yes. And that, that was a great start to his game. And now it's just all about not overextending. Like a lot of people, when they gain that initial momentum against a good player, they will start to overextend a little bit more. And Abyss just has to keep up those solid bread and butters yeah. and rack up safe damage. Yeah, you could even see like the jab jab, which pulled in Tweak a little bit to get an up tilt to up air. Yeah. You get the right hitbox, you get that up tilt, and it can lead to uh, the up air that you got. And Tweak is still at prime percent for being able to be comboed. Yeah. So he has he also had to play safe. Whereas like once he gets the oh that was That's that was such a great chance. Wow, Tweak's dead. Well yeah. Abyss took a stock. Narrowly avoiding that fair. Yeah, and the fact that he avoided that fair led into Tweak just falling to his doom. Oh man, Tweak putting the pressure on though. And uh, I mean, if Abyss, he, wow, he's just up dead. Up throw, up air, just dead. He, I wonder if that was an actual 50-50 because it Abyss looked like to try it. jumping because most of the time Abyss air dodged that uh, the up throw. Yeah, and Tweak could punish it, but that time if he tried jumping. Then that must mean that that could be a potential 50-50 against Fox, or at least just a really good mix-up. Right, and, and a mix-up it was, but the witch time right there on the jab. Ooh. So like Abyss waited for those uh, waited for the witch time then try to jab right on after gets uh gets hit by the bats within instead, and that's why uh, the situation isn't looking as good for him anymore. But I mean, Tweak, I don't know, man. The way I've just been seeing Tweak play at any second, Abyss got to be fearing for his life. Yeah, as I mean, even if you rack up that safe damage. There oh. could be any moment where Tweak just opens up on you. And, and I'm surprised, snaps. like, why don't I see more Bayos just do these up airs? Like, th like Tweak just makes it look like down tilt to up air to up air. Just do that. Yeah. Just do that. Like, yeah, it's so crazy. He also, like, he down tilts, and I think he turns around, too. Yeah, he turns around up tilts. And, and like, he, he, it's very wild. Oh, not going to get the nair there. Oh, and actually, Abyss, out of the jab. Yeah, he's going to find some damage, finds more jabs. Not going to be able to get the perfect pivot Ooh. up tilt. Not a good DI in that so, back air. Yeah, that was an uh, unfortunate way to end the set. He almost got the right hitbox on that jab, but yeah. the tweak nearly popped out of it, and that prevented him from getting the up air. Otherwise, that was a super.